Hey you guys, so welcome to uh, our pre-training video. So in this first video, uh, Coco and I would like to introduce to you the different types of funnel so that you know that when you come on the day when we actually built the funnel, you know what type of funnel we're building and why we're building it. Now, I know a lot of you guys are probably wanting to build funnels that suits your specific needs. Uh, you can imagine what's gonna happen, right? When there's so many people will probably end up building a hundred funnels just to suit every single person. So what we're gonna do is to choose a funnel that we feel is easy enough to uh, have everyone be able to follow step by step. And then after that, the skills that you learn from it, you can actually then implement it into your other funnels that you choose to build. And it's actually quite easy to rebuild the funnels, okay? Um, but either case, I think the funnel that we're gonna be building, you can, you may not use it specifically for uh, what you want directly, but you could use it later down the line, or you could do a few modification and still be able to reuse the funnel. So let's get started. Uh, I'm gonna just make my cell a little bit smaller. There we are. Okay, so let's just open up really big here. Now, as you can see, this is uh, what you will see in Groove Funnels. Now, if you don't already have a Groove Funnel account, uh, please uh, let us know to get our affiliate link um, if you don't already have one. So please email us. It's important that you get our affiliate link so that we can actually support you um, on an ongoing basis if that's what you like to do um, going forward. Now, to start off with, this is... Uh, the different types of funnels, that's a lot of them, right? So instead of going through that, I'm gonna show you that really, in reality, there is a really kind of like mainly three types of funnel that you can, you have to remember, and then it kind of just uh, expand from it. So the first funnel that people love to talk about is what they call an opt-in funnel, okay? Opt-in funnel is really popular because it's about giving things away for free. So I'm sure a lot of you guys here, no doubt, have got things for free from the internet and in exchange for you giving them your name and email, right? And I know a lot of you guys probably give fake emails. That's just how it is, right? But no doubt you guys would have come across these sort of pages and they look like websites, yes, but they're actually what they call funnels. Now, bringing that up about websites and what people will say, well, what's the difference between uh, funnels and websites? Well, funnels is really just another form of website. You know, it's all, it's all a website. Let's just face it, right? So websites, the normal traditional website, it's very much like your landing pages from WordPress and all of that. And you think, well, if a uh, funnel is a website, then why can't we build a, a funnel onto WordPress? Yes, yes, you can but it's just get a bit clunky. Like there's a lot of things that doesn't fit right and it's very manual as opposed to you using an actual funnel builder such as Groove where everything is already laid out for you to actually get you the maximum result that people will actually click onto it, people will actually download it for you. If you use WordPress, there'll be certain things in WordPress templates. It's actually not built to actually get people to engage with you by giving them, giving you uh, their emails or even buying from you because they're not specialized sales websites. So if you're using a WordPress and they give you those WordPress templates and I am a WordPress builder as well, uh, usually they're just more pretty websites, you know, like you buy elegant themes and you make pretty websites that is more uh, a showcase, it's almost like a business card, like it's to show off. But when it comes to building funnels, it's highly recommended that you go with an expert uh, where they all they do is build sales funnel, funnel uh, that will get you a sale, get you a free email so they can build the relationship or even get them to come to your event. Those are what we call very powerful websites, which in other words, we call them funnels. And in this case, we're gonna use Groove Funnels as a very powerful form of software. So this one that you're looking at here is called an opt-in funnel. As you can see, uh, it's giving a promise, in other words, a hook or compelling offer, uh, where it says the top 10 things to ask your builder so you can lower your build cost. So for anyone who's building or renovating and they're wanting to lower their build cost, this book promises to give them those top 10 things, right? And so in order to get this book, uh, they will have to put in their name and email, submit, and then either they'll uh, get the download link straight away or that they would get an email with that book or they might even send them by free shipping, whatever it is. But either way, an opt-in funnel, you're opting in 
uh, with your name and email. And in exchange for that, that other person on the other side that owns this uh, funnel will send you their free gift. Okay, so this is what you call opt-in funnel, right? It's very simple, right? The other one is what we call uh, a webinar funnel. So this is one of my webinar funnels. Uh, now, what is the difference you might ask, right? So webinar funnels, the biggest thing is it has a time. So as you can see, opt-in funnel, people can just give you the name and email anytime, right? But a webinar funnel is, in other words, like an event funnel, okay? Uh, where people will either come to your webinar or your seminar or your conference. Either one is really called what they call a webinar funnel. There is a countdown to it, okay? You can, you can have a video or you don't have to have a video, but the biggest uh, thing is that you have a countdown, okay, to that event to give it some sort of sense of urgency for people to register. And after the event is done, uh, well, they, they can't go anymore, right? So that's the whole point of a webinar uh, or event uh, funnel. And again, same thing as, same thing as an opt-in funnel, funnel. It has a compelling offer, a hook, something that people want to learn and get them to click to want to come to your webinar or your event in order to learn that. And in this case, it's for property developers who wanted to find uh, their partners and they can do that without going to network meetings. So that is a very compelling offer. Okay. So the hook. Now, on top of that, uh, usually with webinar funnels for people to be convinced to come, obviously they will usually follow by what they call three to five secrets here. Okay. So we'll be working on that as well. What is the messaging that you'll be, uh, giving to your audience or your clients in order to entice them to come to your event. Okay. And then if you have been featured in anything, I like to put that there or you don't have to. It could be just as simple as the, the secrets and the time and uh, compelling offer here, as simple as that. Now you might think, okay, well, do I have to have the same thing as an opt-in funnel? Well, yeah, you can, uh, you can or you don't, but usually with opt-in funnel, you don't really have the three secrets because the three secrets is really more to give it some more flavor, um, some more meat into the upcoming event to convince them that not only will you learn about this thing, about how to attract uh, joint venture partners, but to in that webinar, these are the five things you're going to learn. So you better turn up, right? Whereas an opt-in funnel, um, it's just a click of a button. They will get it, right? It really doesn't hurt them. So you don't really need to try too hard per se to give them the three secrets. So in, usually you opt-in funnel is a free thing. People don't usually spend that time to have all that, uh, all those three secrets unless you want to, okay? Uh, the other funnel, obviously, is what they call the sales funnel, where you actually sell something okay so let me have a look but so like this so a lot of you guys here you might go well i don't have anything to give away i don't want to give away for anything and i don't have an event i don't want to do an event i just want to sell my product you know i've got uh some really cool jam i've got some really cool chili jam i've got some really cool cookies or or beautiful cakes um that i want to sell okay and i just need a website to be able to just take payment and off i go so yes, you can do that. So for example, here, you can see that um, you can put maybe your your cakes or your cookies, um, a product, you know, could be jam. I've seen people sell, um, uh, they make their own homemade chilies and, and they sell them as well. Uh, and you can sell them there. I put a picture, very simple. You can take some professional photos, make a collage. And instead of the shapes are not here, you can put um, the jam or the chilies in there. And then you go, yep, this is what I want. Order now. Uh, you can put, you know, where it's from. So why is it so good? You know, it's maybe just three things to make it why, why this product is so good. Um, what's in, in the chili? You can talk a little bit about that. And guess what? You can delete the rest of it if you don't want to. But if you want to follow this template, uh, you can do so. Now, this is a template from GrooveFunnel. It's already built. I didn't build this template, okay? This template comes from GrooveFunnel. That's why I said that um, if you use WordPress, you're not going to get all these powerfully, powerfully built funnels that is perfect to sell your product. Whereas GrooveFunnels has already built it for you. And this is just one of them, one of many, okay? So as you can see here, if you're selling something, you just change the picture 
and off you go. And of course, if you want to change things, and that's what we're going to do on on the final day, I want to show you how to delete, how to navigate, and what sort of messages should you put at the bottom here, okay? And then when you press order now, you might think, okay, what next? When you press order now, well, you get taken to a sales page, uh, the next page, and it looks a bit like this. So you might go, this is, uh, this is what they're getting. You might even put, you know, when is it going to deliver it, blah, 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 whatever it is. Let's just say we're selling chili. Uh, and this is the payment form. And uh, not get free access, you know, like you can change the form. And again, that's something that can be done in Groove as well. And pay now and off you go, right? So you can do all these three things, whether it's getting a, f uh, you're f getting free, giving away a free book or free something and so that you can get the email and the name to build a relationship and then to follow up with more emails and eventually some one day sell something to them or you are wanting to invite them to an event to come and listen to you talk and then at the end of the event you selling something a course a program a product or you don't have that you just want to sell them a product like a jar of chili homemade or cakes or cookies and off you go or any handicrafts that you're making, anything that you have, you can use this one as well. So what I call is one is an opt-in funnel, okay? Uh, where I just collect name and email. The second one is a webinar funnel. Why is it called webinar funnel or event funnel? Well, because there's a countdown, right? Gives it away, there's a countdown. And usually you have a bit of meat in it by giving uh, some more information about what is it that you're gonna cover so that they actually turn up or even, turn up and actually register for the event. If they're not interested in what you have to say, well, they're not going to register to the event. Whereas this one here is very easy. They just put the name and email that they get their free book, right? Uh, and then thirdly, of course, this sales funnel here, if you're selling something. Now, I'm oversimplifying what those different funnels are. Obviously, there is more than just these three main funnels. And I don't want to confuse you, but if you go through this list of Groove Funnels here, so this actually inside Groove Funnels, see all these pre-built templates? They're there for if you are a Groove member, okay? Now you can get a free membership, okay? Now you don't have to upgrade to actually use uh, Groove uh, Funnels. Uh, instead, I encourage you to get a free membership and play around with it. And it's free, unlimited, not free for one week or free for one month or whatever, free for life at the basic membership, you would only upgrade to a paid membership if you want to have unlimited funnels and more templates to play with, okay? So for the purpose of our uh, funnel day, you don't need a paid um, account. If you don't already have a paid account, I suggest you uh, don't need to get a paid one until you see and have a look through what it can do for you before you actually buy it, okay? Just use the free account for now, okay? If you, you don't already have an account, just set up the free account. Um, now you can see here, you can have a funnel to schedule appointments right here. You can have one that is what they call a landing page. Where is that landing page? Uh, okay, a landing page, oh, this is a challenge page. Um, what else is there? So you can see here, there's a lot of here, there's like a medical service and landing page. So that's more like your WordPress site, you know, the pretty site that, that people will do and not necessarily a sales page, just more like an information page, you can use Groove Funnels as well. So let's just say that you go, oh, but does that mean I have to have my WordPress account with GoDaddy and all that? No, you can actually just use Groove Funnels, build out your business card website, what I call it business card because it's like a WordPress website where it's just information about yourself. You don't have to give anything away for free. It's just information. You can do all that in Groove, right? Because Groove is, is a website builder, right? It just so happened to specialize in funnels where it makes people take action to buy something, to give you something, okay? Whether it's money, whether it's an email, okay? Um, so back to what will we do on the day? So on the day, I'm going to go in the middle. I'm not going to build out like a whole sales page. It's going to take a long time. And I'm not going to go anything too simple either. So what we're going to do that day, we are actually going to build a webinar funnel where I'm going to show you how to add your timer in there. Uh, Coco is going to help you with the messaging, how to come up with your hook and also the three to five secrets as well to make it uh, compelling enough that people actually turn up to your event. Now, if you don't have an event, that's fine. Just listening because maybe in future you might have, have an event. event. Um, you may not have to do this part, but certainly you will need this thing up here. You know, why is it that you need it? Now, um, 
if you are someone that is just selling a product, you go, oh, I'm just selling products. I don't need um, any of the opt-in funnel or anything like that. Well, even if you're selling a product, you need to be able to come up with a good, compelling headline uh, like this. So why is your, your, your cookie so good? What makes it unique? You can't just come and set up a page and go, cookies for sale, right? No, you've got to come up with, why is the cookie so good, right? Is it... Uh, uh, delicious cookies without the calories? Uh, is it homemade cookies from Eastern Malaysia? Uh, is it homemade f- uh, from butter from New Zealand? Like something, right? So you still gonna need to learn all that. And you look at this one, you know, the three things, why is, what is the benefit of, of your product? Why is it so special? You still need to come up with these messages as well, even if you're selling a product. So in order to meet in the middle and so that it kind of applies to everyone, all these skills of building a funnel and the messaging that Coco is going to cover, we are going to go through what we call a, a webinar funnel. Okay. Now, what do you have to do as homework? Well, kind of nothing except for the fact that you know what funnel is before you turn up uh, on the day. Okay. Um, and be prepared to know in your mind, what is it that you want to achieve on the day? Uh, are you someone that just going to sell products or you're going to give away something for free? Um, have a think about where you stand so that you know uh, what sort of messaging that you need Coco's help with. And when you, when I take you step by step on how to build out these funnels, I'm going to show you how to implement and take one of these templates and how to modify it very easily uh, without actually tearing your, your hair out. Okay. So uh, that's it, guys. If you have any other questions at all, please uh, shoot us an, uh, an email, of course, and then we will uh, get back to you either on a video or we'll reply directly privately to your email. All right, guys. Until then, bye.